Hey what's going on guys, my name is Silent Core and welcome to RuneScape Quick Tips Episode 3. So today we're going to be going into prayers and there's actually been 8 new prayers added in to help balance the, I guess the combat triangle within the evolution of combat. So there's been 2 new prayers added into the curse book, which are both similar to Turmoil, these are the 3 at the bottom here, and uh, they all require 95 prayer. So Turmoil is the one that we had before and it increases your melee strength, your melee defense by a fixed amount, and it also drains your opponent's melee attack, strength and defense. The two new that have been added are Anguish and Torment, and these are just the equivalent for the range and then the equivalent for the mage. So Anguish being the range one and Torment being the magic one. These two new prayers are also unlocked after completing the temple at Seniston. So there were actually six new prayers added onto the normal prayer book, but there was an update to date that removed four of these and they made similar changes that they didn't announce on the homepage, such as they made dungeoneering a little bit harder so you can't two hit bosses anymore. So uh, the new two prayers that have been added are Overcharge and Overpowering Force and uh, the four they removed were kind of lower level ones, uh, lower level prayers, so level 9, level 27 uh, ones to help boost your range or magic. So I guess they wanted to remove those and make prayer a little bit less confusing but still keep the two best ones. So we've still got the level 44 uh, prayer Overpowering Force that increases your range strength and then the level 45 prayer that increases your magic strength Overcharge. The two prayers down here, Rigor and Augury, were originally, you could buy these with Dungeoneering tokens before the EOC, and uh, now they're actually unlocked through the King's Ransom quest, just like Paiete is. And if you've already unlocked Paiete, you will obviously have these unlocked, so you won't have to go back to the Knight's Wave thing to unlock these, thankfully. And if you did originally unlock these with your Dungeoneering tokens, those will be refunded to you, so you'll already have those in your tokens box. So I guess put those to use and maybe buy yourself an offhand Chaotic Rapier. Mm -hmm.